Hey, what's up you guys? Long time no vlog. I've been insanely busy, but today is Sunday and I've got the whole day off from work. And if you can tell, there is sunshine out there. I'm going to be going to enjoy it. So I'm gonna take you guys along. Uh, I'm going over to Koshikawa Kurakuen Gardens, which is quite close to my apartment. So hopefully there'll be some plum blossoms that are blooming and I can look at those and just enjoy being outdoors and not in an office. That'll be good. Um, but yeah, I need to give you guys a life update because things have been changing recently, so that will be necessary. It's kept me quite busy, but in a good way, so I will probably tell you guys that here in a bit. Okay, well then I guess I'm a list of updates. The first, and I would argue most important, is that I have accepted a position and began working in an international school. So I'm actually in an administrative role, so I'm not teaching. Also, it's not in a language school, so this is not an Aikaiwa or anything like that. It's not an English program. It's Well, it is an English program, but it's flat out a curriculum for students as though they were in their home countries. So I'm loving it. I'm loving it so much, um, I've been able to meet a lot of really incredible people. Uh, I'm not going to talk about my job on YouTube pretty much at all, mainly because I just don't think it's very appropriate. I mean, I'm, we work with children, we work with the families of these kids, and I'm not ever going to post that anywhere, so I just don't really feel like it's necessary, but it was it's interesting for you guys to know that I'm no longer a student and I'm working, and I am working at a school, just not the typical school that a lot of foreigners work in. Um, so yeah, that's, that's going great, I love it. And because of this job, I am able to get my own apartment. Yee! So that's the second update is next weekend I move into my own place that I'm getting. It's huge. It's literally one station from my current apartment, so I don't have to go that far, which is really nice. It's still in the area that I like. I'm just, like 2017 has been incredible to me so far. And I can't, like, even if it's mediocre after these few months, I'm okay with that. I've had a great few months and I can't wait to just see how it like continues to get better. But yeah, that's my big updates that I've got it going on. It's absolutely gorgeous outside today. I'm really glad that I'm getting out of my little hole of an apartment. I mean, I know I'm leaving it in a week, but it's still good to get out of there and not have to deal with it anymore. Um, and kind of get out and just enjoy. Like, look at that. It's so nice out. And I'm almost at the gardens, which means I can see all the flowers. foreigners. I love hearing them talk very loudly. Um, I don't know if you can see that white thing up there. That, that is Tokyo Dome. So we're very close to that and they've got like a theme park over there too that I've always wanted to go to but just haven't done it. <laughs> Maybe sometime soon. We've been doing this construction for a while so we're on like a fake sandbag walk. They've got this waterfall over there and they used to have a red bridge on it. It was really pretty. They're doing a lot of construction over here. It's still gorgeous though. There's some fish jumping over there. Yeah. You can't see it, but there's a hummingbird that's fishing and diving into the water and all the photographers are very excited about it. Very cool. One of my favorite things about this park is that there is all kinds of like twisting paths that go all over and there's just greenery everywhere. So well, there's a lot of people here, but you're not constantly surrounded by them, which is quite nice. Oh, the sunlight. So yeah, it's been really good to just sort of get out of the city. I mean, I'm still in it, obviously, but I feel like I'm out of the city, but I'm still there and just kind of get some greenery. Yeah, I'm from Ohio. I'm used to trees and farms and all kinds of green stuff.
head back here in a little bit. Um, just because I have a lot of packing I need to do. And I also need to get some lunch. So I'm going to get some ramen at my favorite place. But who wants to leave this? I'm here at Book Off. And I've been looking for some like kids books to practice my reading because I am terrible. And they have these like fairy tales. This is Momo Pato. I know the story, but I don't. It's all in Japanese. They've got Sweetie Gana, which is perfect. And they've got a bunch of these. So I'm gonna get this one. I'm gonna get Kaguyahime. These are ones that I know the stories. So as far as the meaning goes, not as important. It's just learning words. And I can mark them up because they're old, they're used, so I don't mind. They're only 200 words. And they've got like... At this one, they've got all kinds of them. I also was quite entertained. They have one of my favorite books, um, this series. And here we have my favorite ramen. This one right there is what I'm getting. It's like a super manly ramen, but basically it has karage in it. So you get ramen with fried chicken as a part of it. It's my favorite thing. It's cold day, so I'm getting it. I guess I can't put off packing anymore. <laughs> All right, well, I'm back now. I have a lot to pack. As you can see, my place, is, I've got like a table, I've got like a suitcase, I just, I need to keep going through stuff. So I've had my fun, I've gotten out of the house, saw some sunshine, time to go pack and keep going because that move is gonna be great. And I'm gonna be really excited in that apartment. So I will share that with you guys, hopefully, unless I forget or I get too busy and I just drop the ball and no, don't, but hopefully I do. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you want to subscribe and watch more of me ranting and occasionally updating on things, you can go ahead and subscribe down below. Or if you have any questions or anything, just put them down there. I may or may not respond. Hopefully I do, um, but yeah, see you guys later.